everyone this is v with real journal talk and so today's video is going to be my cash envelope stuffing video for the last paycheck in may so you're if you're interested in watching please stay tuned all right you guys so i actually am um going to count the money that i actually have allocated out for this cash envelope stuffing and um See if I have anything left remaining from any of my cash envelopes and then we will see how I decide to actually use any rollover money. So let's get started. So let's see. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60, 80, 300. And 20, 40, 60. That's what I use to for my cash envelopes okay so I actually usually stuff my groceries with 140 as you can see this time there is nothing remaining from the grocery envelope so we are going to go ahead and put that 140 in here Let's see 20 40 60 80 100 20 40 and I hope you all are having a great or had a great week and enjoying the weekend as I am and I want to say thank you all for returning back to my channel and for those who are new welcome thank you so much for um, joining this video and so for kids uh, the kids get 10 a piece per pay period for chores and so it looks like the kids actually um, did use that from the last one so we're gonna just put in 20 and we have gas I do 40 per pay period uh, 20 40 and then for cleaning um, 20 and this actually needs to go um, in my actual account because I ended up using my debit card um, last week. So this 20 is going to go back in my account to replace for um, me spending it out my regular budget. So I'm sitting that to the side. So I'm going to do 20. And the goal is to increase this to 40, but I have to kind of see. But I want to increase this to 40. But for now, I'm sticking with 20. <laughs> Movie, I do 20. And it's, as you can see, there's nothing left here, so that means we use that for um, movies. Mm. And then taxes. This is part of the sinking funds um, that I'm doing for my taxes because they're coming up in August. And I want to at least have some of the money ready um, because I can do it in installments uh, for the prior year. So I do 40 per pay period, so 20, 40. And as you can see, um, this will stay in here due to the fact that um, it's a sinking fund. So, and then we have the YouTube. Um, so, of course, I will be utilizing this because I'm actually um, looking at um, some items that I need to for my channel. Um, some things that I purchased and you'll see that on my um, closeout budget for April some items that I purchased and so with that being said I will be utilizing the money that's in here um, that's left over because of some items I need to get with that so I'm going to take this out if I can get it open um, and so let's see what I had in here 20 40 60 80. Let me see. Hold on. 20, 40, 60, 80. Um, I don't think I need that much. So, oh, hold on, y'all. 20, 40, 60, 80. 100. 20, 40, 60. I don't think I need that much. 20, 40, 60, 80. I'm going to take out 80 because I think the items that I'm getting, it should be no more than $80 and something. So I am not going to take all of that out. Let me sit that to the side 
and I'll put leave the 20, 40, 68, and I'll leave 80 in here because, like I said, this is for my channel as well as um, anything that I want to purchase to um, do my planning with or to get um, a gift for giveaway. So I do 40 per pay period with this, and so I'm putting in another 40 for this pay period. And then um, personal, I do 40 for self. And that's 20, 40. <clears throat> and then um, if you watch my last cash envelope stuffing video, um, this actually was the money that I had left over um, from the previous um, cash envelope video. So what I did was... I just used one of my old envelopes that I had um, for another wallet that I was using, like maybe last year or something. And so I took the rem the money that I didn't use and put it in this envelope. And I was going to make a decision on how I was going to use this money um, at the end of the month, which is now because the month is over. And what was left over was 20, 40, 60, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 88. And what I did was I, let me see. Oh, what I did was I decided to purchase me um, an updated, um, a new laptop because I have been in the need for one and I have been so busy saving towards savings, paying off debt that I needed one. And so when I uh, just received a refund in the mail, I said, okay, well, Val, this is not part of your um, um, budget. Go ahead and use this before you decide to save it on something and just do something nice for yourself. And so I used that and then I added some money at my savings, but I need to put this with that money so that way I can put that back in my savings. So I'm gonna take this $88 and put it back in my account since I had to use it to go with the money out of my savings. So this is what I'm doing with this. And then going forward, I did look at you guys' comments who did give some ideas as far as either using it as a, putting it towards savings, any money that's left over, or some guys, some of you all are saying um, that you're using it as rollover for the next bill that you may have or um, something that you're looking at purchasing that you may not even um put in your budget but it's something that you're thinking about and so i'm thinking that that's what i'm gonna do because i'm always saving and always paying off something and never doing something for myself so i think that's what i'll do for any type of um extra money that's left out of these envelopes is i'll just let it accumulate and if it's something that i'm thinking about then and <laughs> and if i purchase it then i'll just take the money out this envelope and put it back in the account. So that's what I'm planning on doing. And I want to thank you all for um, giving me some great ideas. So um, thanks. So anyways, this is supposed to be a quick short video. I don't want to be blabbing. But thanks for watching. And that's basically it for this cash and little stuff and video. Please remember to give me a big thumbs up. Um, share, comment, and please, please click the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to my channel. Thanks. Bye.